Hey there, Johnny Starr here. Just going to play some blues today. Okay, so let's take a look at the scale pattern that I was using to solo with. We're playing over top of a B minor 7 most of the time and using the pentatonic scale shape. However, it turns out this is a B Dorian pentatonic. I only know that because I looked it up after I finished recording the solo. The B Dorian pattern starts with Re of the Do Re Mi scale on the B note. If we were to use all the notes of the Do Re Mi scale instead of just that pentatonic, we could throw in that Mi and T notes up there on the top three strings. I just look at the uh, which extra ones I have. That T and Mi. But let's take a look at what we can do if we use the B minor scale or call it a B minor pentatonic and then add in all the do re mi notes with a you can see the fa and the t we'd start here so i've thrown in a fa and a t instead of the mi and the t hear the difference here we got the fa and we'll do the me. Difference between just the one note. Let's take a look how to use that B minor scale. Much like Jimmy Page does in uh, Since I've Been Loving You. So sweet with that fa note when he comes in with a Okay, so mess around with the two different scales. Throw in those extra spicy notes in your pentatonic shape. Again, I didn't know it was a B Dorian scale. I just know my shapes. And, uh, you know, if you want a simplified visual way to learn the Do, Re, Mi map all the way up and down the neck so that you can play these kinds of modes, not just two of them, but all seven different modes just by shifting this map up and down the neck, uh, check out my visual guitar music theory program on johnnystar.com. So keep messing around with your pentatonic shape and add in the extra spicy notes from these two different scales. And... Uh, have some fun. I'll see you next time. Thanks for being with me.